honestly tell you, Drew is a cold, callous person. A former friend of Drew Peterson is speaking out. Tonight, he describes a bizarre online flirtation with a former Bolingbrook cop. Good evening, I'm Ann State. And I'm Rob Johnson. Right when you thought the Drew Peterson saga couldn't get any stranger, it has. Tonight's developments involve sex, lies, and audio tape. Now, both men at the center of this war of words are going public with their very different versions of the story. Here's CBS2 West Suburban Bureau Chief Mike Puccinelli. The wire used to be stashed in here. Len Wazak is showing where investigators hid recording devices so they could listen in on conversations between Wazak, his wife Paula Stark, and Drew Peterson. And they weren't only listening. Extremely small spy cams were also set up. It was right here. Investigators listened when Wazak and his wife were at Peterson's home over a period of seven months recording their conversations with the former cop. Wazak says there are countless hours of tape. I would have to say there's a uh, hmm, thousand hours, maybe more. If they have tapes, bring it on, I'm sure it's going to clear me. He's delusional. Wazak is convinced Peterson is about to be locked up. I go off of what I've been told. An arrest is imminent on him. Wazak decided to cooperate with police because he believes Peterson killed his third and fourth wives. Peterson says Wazak and Stark bonded with his kids and then abandoned them. And now all of a sudden these people just coldly disappeared from their lives. More people disappearing from their lives. And I thought, that, I thought Lenny and Paula, that was a cruel thing. He says he went undercover to try and help Peterson's four children. I don't think they can afford to have another female brought into their life and get attached to them just for dad to go ahead and, you know, Give a divorce, man, you know, in a bathroom or, uh, you know, upstairs in a bedroom. And Wazak says Peterson spent hours trolling the Internet, trying to find his next girl. That's where Peterson met Ashley. He became real fond of Ashley. And today, for the first time, we learned Ashley's true identity. And Ashley would be me. I am the real Ashley. I'm the one who did the blog. I'm the one that romance Drew. Drew is going to signal his love for Ashley, me on Larry King Live by pulling on his ear. He said every time he tugged on his ear, that meant he loved me. Wazak says Peterson tugged on his ear three times during that interview. Wazak also said through tears that he never dreamed in a million years he'd get so attached to Peterson's children, children that he now knows he no longer will get to see. Ann? Mike, thanks so much for all of that.